Hi guys, welcome to this video. I'm Prashant. I'm the founder of Word Pandit and I'm bringing this series of videos to you wherein I explain previous year CAT questions. Today we've got a CAT 2017 RC question. Before you go through this video solution, make sure you've solved the question before. Uh, let's get to the question at hand. The question at hand here is the author uses ironic in the third paragraph to point out that. So why has the author used this particular word? And we've got four options. Let's go to the context, understand the context first and then we will understand why has he used this particular word word the lines say as for what staunches creativity that's easy if ironic so what stops what forestalls what what stops creativity from fully developing is that's easy to identify even if it is ironic now what is the reason it's the very institutions that we build to manage exploit and perpetuate the fruits of creativity so things which were meant to if this can be in short you can label it as things which were meant to aid creativity are bureaucracies and sad to say too many of our schools so these are the things the very things that were meant to aid and support and foster and manage and exploit creativity these are the very things that are uh, stifling it, stopping its development. Creativity is disruptive. Schools and organizations are regimented, standardized and stultifying, which is ineffectively crippling. So the things which were meant to support it, those are the things which are stopping it, right? So that's the irony in this. Irony refers to a sentiment where what there is a difference in what you expect between the expected outcome and what actually happens. So generally they are of an opposite nature and that in itself, the feeling that develops in such a scenario is called irony which is the option that highlights this option number b directly highlights this institutions created to promote creativity eventually stifle it right so they don't let it breathe option number b is our answer here option number a people need social contact rather than isolation to nurture their creativity remember institutions have to be present in this answer option and this is not about people this is about institutions see the larger the creative population in a city, the more likely it is to be stifled. The thing is here is in this particular context, the size of the population is not even mentioned. It is not even correlated, hence ruled out. A and C are ruled out. Option number D does have large bureaucracies and large bureaucracies and institutions in it, but does it make sense? Large bureaucracies and institutions are the inevitable outcome of successful cities. The problem with this is this does not even correlate with the topic of creativity. Uh, we don't even know what how does this correlate to creativity and stifling it. Hence, this is outside the the context of the passage hence ruled out the only option which fits here is option number b this is the explanation for this question hopefully so you're clear with the explanation now thank you very much for watching this video and as always happy learning